Hello, my name is Edgar. My name is Servando. And we're both guest lecturers at www.grossimath.com. Today we'll be learning about product row of exponents and Servando will help you simplify algebraic expressions by using the product rule. So here we already have a sample problem set up. So first we look at the coefficient. We look, now here we have a three and a two. You need to multiply them and that will get six. Next you look at the variables. Here we have an x, put it down here next to the six. We look for other x's. Here we have another x, it's alone, so that means it has a, a one. So now you just add the three and the one, and that'll get you four. So you put x to the four. Next, you look for the, another variable. Here we have a y. Look for any other y's, it's by itself. So you put it in there. You put it down here next to the x. You look for the next variable. Here we have a z. Look for any other z's. Here we have another one. Now you just add the two and the three, and that'll get you five. And this is your final answer. Now Edgar will show you another example, this time with a negative number. Here in this problem, we have negative 4a squared, b to the power of 3, c to the power of 3, 3b squared, c. OK, so the first thing that we're going to do is multiply the negative 4 times the 3, which will give you negative 12. Now we get the variables, which is a squared. So there's if there's no other. Um, letters that can go with it, that means it's already simplified. So you can just put it down there. Here we have another one, which is B, and it's B squared, I mean, B to the power of three and B squared. So you just add them and you'll get B to the power of five. The next one is C, and we have C to the power of three and C by itself. So if it's whenever it's by itself, all you have to do is do a plus one because it's one letter. So it'll be c to the power of 4. Um, today, we showed you how to use product row of exponents by simplifying algebraic expressions. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can visit our website at www.grossimath.com for more information.